Hey everybody, good morning, good morning. My eyes look sleepy in intro. Anyway, I'm just trying to soak up some sea. See? Some sea? And some sun. Can you see the sun? I'm nice view, right? Anyways, um I thought just came to me and I thought I'd I'd share. What I'm trying to say is that over the years we have seen ourselves as Jamaicans as being resilient to a lot of things. Right? Well, and it's it's kind of true and 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 the nature the nature that we have plays a a role in 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 a lot of this but the onus is on us to take more responsibility for the things that we do and understand that the things that we do affect not just the people you pass on the streets and so on but your immediate family as well and until we accept that fact and stop thinking that oh we're gonna bounce back oh we're gonna bounce back oh we're gonna come back from this we need to stop thinking that let let god work and care we're back but take that mindset out of take it out of your head that we're gonna bounce back don't take it for granted that we're gonna bounce back right yes we're gonna bounce back and we're living on that premise but don't take it for granted that you're gonna bounce back do your part so that we can bounce back so even when the bounce back come, you have bragging rights and say, yeah, me didn't know, so we have a bounce back. But if you don't do your part, right? If you don't get up and say, you know, I need to stop doing this or I need to do this, then um, the, 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 the bounce back may never come, if you understand what I'm trying to say. Because um, take, for example, this pandemic that we're going through. You know, I've been to so many places and I've seen where persons threw in the towel and they're not doing the social distancing they're not doing so many things i know we're at a point where we're fed up it's been months right because um it started in march here and it's now october we have never gone through anything for that long time and so you know persons just take it for granted no the, the talk is if a dirt a dirt sometimes the dirt is really dirty if you understand sometimes the dirt it's hard and it can't dig sometimes it's too loose and you fall through so we need to stop and think about it and do our part you understand don't take the next person for granted right don't take it that the other person that you see on the street or the other person that you're standing behind in the line is healthy right it's not necessarily so because remember, the, the, the Ministry of Health did say that there are persons who are asymptomatic. So they'll be, car they'll be a carrier and they themselves don't even know. So it's up, and it's up to you. And not, you can't just get up and say, oh, my immune system is strong. Your immune system might be strong, but what about your mommy and daddy? What about your children? What about your wife? What about your husband, your boyfriend, your girlfriend? What about those persons who you love and you come in contact with? What about the little old lady down the street where you go buy your eggs or you go buy your, 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 um, your kerosene oil or any little soap and them little something there, them thing there? Yeah, you don't know what is happening. So let us do our part. Let us keep Jamaica safe. Um, I, I, I yearn for the day when I can hear that the cases are trending down or, you know, we are where we were a few months ago where we had just a few and and people could relax a little but as it is now let us continue to pray let us continue to do our part and think of it as um think of it as it is but think of it as it is my responsibility to keep my family safe and to keep myself safe so let me give you a little bit more view of the sun and the sea and then i can say bye bye toodles be safe remember you don't know who is who you don't know what is what love you all